Greetings and hallucinations, ladies and lads. I am Chancellor of the Harmonious Frequencies of the Mighty Empire of Onion, and this is Fallout 76. Psycho? You folks and your drugs. Which I need to start using because I have too many of them. What in the world? Elevator pods. Okay. Wow. This place is crazy. Oh, there's a lot of them down there, actually. By a lot, I mean three. There's a medical center over there. Is that where I'm headed? It looks like it. Yeah. This is the place. Looks pretty quiet so far. Killing rad roaches? I may be fine just using my pitchfork here. Got ourselves a security door in here that I don't see a way to... Ah. We could use the keypad, but we don't know the code. Okay, well, I, I think I'll wrap this up. I guess I'm off to pick some flowers. Ah, <laughs> oh, stolen supplies, huh? Here we go. 011986. Perfect. All right. Left. There we go. Magical. Lots of buff out, I think. Red X's, stim packs. Oh man, Maria Chavez, you did not. You did not pick this place clean. Yep. Buff out Rad X. Not too shabby. Not a lot, but not bad. There's somewhere around here that I haven't been because I can hear a scorched walking around. But I cannot find them. Yeah, sounds like he's right over here, but. Is there a fourth floor? I guess there is. The stairs don't lead up to it, but... There must be. And the building is separated up a little bit because... Those stairs... I mean, the second and third floors over here is not the same as the ones over at uh, the other side of the building. Alright. Nice little locked door here. Oop. Almost snapped it. There we go. Not too terrible. I am getting low on cement, I'd say. Okay, but I still haven't found what I'm looking for yet. Yeah, we're up on the top floor again. Okay, we must be having to go downstairs then. Which makes me nervous because I'm not sure how we get back up from there. Oh well. Okay, so these reactors here. Oh, bit of radiation. Yeah, this ought to have a fusion core. It doesn't, though. Very interesting. Ah, oh, requires skill one. Why? I'm gonna have to level up intelligence again. Maybe I already have the card, though.
No, we don't have a uh, we don't have a hacking card. That's something I may need to grab. Cause I would love to open this door. Uh, I don't know why though. There's nothing really in there. Canisters. I don't see ammo. That's just a can of some kind. I don't know what it is. Potato crisp, maybe? Oh no, that's three rolls of duct tape stacked up on top of each other. Yeah, I do want to get in there now. Oh well. Okay. So down there, that can't be an exit door, right? That has to be my objective. Oh, there's a duct tape right there. Wonderful. Okay, and here's stairs up too that I didn't recognize from the top. Here's stairs that go more downer. This is fine. Okay, here we are finally. Oh, a severe 44, eh? It's pretty powerful. I think that's what I put on my 10 millimeter was the severe because it increases uh, regular and critical damage. So that was pretty appealing to me. All right, the overview. Produce a vaccine against the mutagenic effect known as the scorched plague. Install the type T fuse, collect a blood sample from a mole rat, a feral ghoul, and a wolf. Okay. Journals. Install the Type T fuse. What does that mean? Oh, right here. There we go. So now we need the blood samples. I wonder if we we're supposed to do that. Is there a specific way to do that? I didn't notice. Not loaded in the centrifuge. Okay. Extract samples from three candidate creatures. Use blood sample analysis to create synthetic antibodies. So it doesn't say with what. Do I... Maybe I have to shoot them with the syringe or something. Collect blood samples, huh? Mole rat, feral ghoul, and a wolf. I feel like we're going to have to come back here once we do that. Put them in the centrifuge and uh, analyze. Which is fine. Wow. I didn't even notice this entire staircase over here. This is the door I came in, too. Okay. Well, we're done with this place then, for now. Alright, getting a little bit thirsty. Could do with the food as well, I guess. Oh, look at all this spoiled meat. Gross. Huh, interesting. Not sure why some of the sugar bombs give me rads and some don't. Uh, we might be able to do with a diluted... Uh, let's go for a full. Just get rid of all of them. Oh, okay. So it gives me specific places to collect them at. We're headed up here next, though. Amy's terminal password. Let's get this done and out of the way. This is a train yard. I don't know if this counts as a train station. But I'm still waiting to find out if the tooltip is correct about... train stations having stash boxes and stuff. Ah, these guys. Yeah, so this is certainly not what I'm looking for. Steel worker hat?
Yeah. So the train yard is much different from a station, I suppose. Let's get out of here. Is this another huge cliff? It kind of is a big drop off there. Dang it. Maybe we go around? If possible. Yeah, there's a staircase over there. Oh, what in the world? A diseased Grafton monster? Gross. Look at that hideous thing. That's like something from Resident Evil. Hey, stop chasing me, you dirty commies. Really? Got him. Oh, this is an 18? Man, he's doing serious damage. A red star pin? Okay. Oh, that thing's getting closer. He's only a 10, so I think we could take him pretty easy, but... Ugh. I'd like to say that I could be less... Uh... Flippant with the damage that I take. But we're really not doing that bad right now. Okay, here's Charleston Station. Is that one that I'm leaving? Hornwright Industrial HQ. Well, Mr. Handy, you want to help me with these uh, mongrels? No? I guess not. It was two more, right? I think there's one on each side of me. There we go. Pretty sure these dog meats are why I had all that spoiled meat in my pockets. Who's that? Oh. It's a dead man. Okay. So this is a station. Ammunition vending machine? That's pretty cool. And maybe I could sell some of my stuff to this guy. Let's go, yeah, these. I want all of these to sell. Station information. Ticketing. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Okay. Information. Enjoy. <laughs> Error. Invalid. Okay. Ammunition and gear. Let's take one of those out to sell. They aren't worth very much, but it'll be something. Um, can I now store the more hooks mod? No. Why not? They weigh the same. So let's see if we can sell him. Nope. These are his notes, right? Be sure to stock up while you can. Yeah, I can't sell him those notes. That's crazy. Yeah, we'll sell both those for six coins. Six caps, whatever. Yeah, so instead of breaking down all of my uh, clothes that I couldn't wear, I should have sold them. I didn't think about it until just now. But that Don't was pretty silly. 
the wasteland without the proper supplies. They're not worth very much, though, is the only thing. He doesn't want to buy ammo. He doesn't buy notes either. Okay. Well. Uh, I guess I could just if toss these notes. To trade, I can be of service. I'd love to give them to somebody, though, instead. But I think most of these are really easy to, uh, to learn and to find. So I don't know if anybody would want them in the first place. Is there a cooking station around here, though? Aha! Protest signs. Yes. Against automation. Jobs today or blood tomorrow. That's hilarious. Oh, man. That takes me back. That episode where those guys showed up with the protest signs was so good. They were hilarious. Okay. I don't know why, but that's one of my favorite songs from the first uh, from Fallout 3. It's just catchy. Oh man, these uh, these cliffs make me really nervous now after encountering those death claws at the other the other place similar to this. I think we're gonna be fine though because we're still in the green area. Oh, that superstructure thing up there really uh, interests me, though. I would love to see what that is up close. Something spawned in and died, sounds like. Oh, man. I would love it if y'all could tell me about any other uh, MMO that uh, limits your storage space. I was just trying to think about it, and I guess several of them really do. I can't remember about World of Warcraft. I was thinking that there was limited uh, slots in your bank or whatever, and you couldn't store more than a certain number of items. So I guess it has to do with, like, server memory or something like that. And that's probably the reason why uh, they have it limited. I, I don't like it at all, you know? Even if I knew the cause behind it, I still wouldn't want it to be that way. Come on, please swing. Good grief. I only had to click it about five times. Fifteen. Dead. Did you really only have dog tags? Okay. That's more like it. Gold watch. Oh. Took me a minute. Okay. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Perfect. More technical data. Delicious. Oh, these are actually creams. That's pretty good. I wonder if there's, uh, there's got to be a crafter recipe for those, I would think. Oh, here he is. She. Password, uh, is Babylon. Okay. Make sure the Brotherhood doesn't get their hands on it. Fine. Where's this red roach at? Oh. Sure. Aha! I see ya. Hiding. Come on. There we go. Sadly, I can't fast travel because I'm over-encumbered. Otherwise, I would just zip on over to where we're supposed to be now and uh, finish up this quest, but... Lo and behold. Ah, 
I talked to Sheila yesterday about finding some food. She said she'd give me the info about a place if I grabbed some food for both of us. So I agreed, and she pointed me to an old building nearby filled with machines that could make something she called it cream. No, I never heard of it, but she promised that it tasted good and it would keep us both from starving. We have to return to this environmental monitoring program, which is fine. Let's see if we can cross this bridge. Looks like it might be broken in a couple of places, but maybe it's been patched up with some plywood or something. Sometimes they are. We could at least see, though, because, like I said, it intrigues me. Okay, got a couple of baddies. Yeah, this is probably fine. Oh, it leads to a door. That's creepy. Not so much worried about the leather right now. I don't know, besides leather armor, if there's anything else I need it for. Oh no. Are those dang uh, blood bugs? Because if they are... I'm getting out of here. I hate those things. What did that say? Deflated kickball. Okay. So I could try to get over there. But what's the point? It's a sleeping bag and arrow. Oh, the lag really makes me nervous when I'm in situations like that. Oh yeah, here they are. Get so dead, you filthy creature. Oh, disease? Nice. What are they doing in the green area? That's what I want to know. Whoa. I thought I was toast there. Okay. Dead. There's a couple more ghouls over there, but I'm not interested in killing a bunch of them. I just want to get back to the, uh, the mission end. East Bridge Key. I mean, we may need it for the future. Believe it or not, I've finally learned how to block. It's crazy, right? But it's open as well, which is strange to me. Alright, buddy. You do you. Eighteen caps, that's pretty good. Camden Park to meet our buyer. Doug, I've taken your key to the west door. I'm sorry, but I can't keep coming back to find new dings and scratches just because you can't resist taking our little project out for a spin. We're trying to sell this thing, remember? Look, assuming this guy shows, I'll be back by the seat. The buyer's a military type. He wants to make the trade while riding the Widowmaker? No idea why. I think he's living out some kind of personal spy fantasy. That's fine by me. I wanted to try that ride since I was a kid. Here's some kind of a resort. Wonderful. It's full of, uh... Ghouls. Oh, we got a photo frame. Eh, how many times did he, uh, attack me there? with several. Oh no. Is that a bloat fly? 
I haven't even seen those yet until now. So I was reading about it and apparently they throw their larva at you. Which is really gross. Really gross. Oh, I see. It is a soft shell too, so I could get those cakes going. If I could get to a camping spot before they spoil. I guess it wouldn't be a bad idea to get that uh, perk card that slows down the spoil time. Brown mole rat. Gross. Alright, yet another train station. Come on. Let me over, please. I just want to sneak over the wall. Come on. Oh, why can't I go forward? There we go. This is fantastic. Whoa. It's just a frame standing here. I don't know why all of these places don't have uh, cooking stations available. Maybe there is one. If I just look around a bit. But I really am not seeing it at all. And I'm going to assume that it isn't here. Because if it was, it would be like right here. I would think. Oh well. Let's keep going. We're almost there. Oh man. After all this time, we're back at the uh, water treatment plant again. With these dirty commie robots. Get out of here, you. Whoa. And yeah. Sometimes they do the weirdest things. I wonder if I scrapped that uh, red pin that I picked up from the one. Because I was kind of interested in taking a look at that. I imagine that I did because I don't think it's apparel. Nope. Oops. Okay. So now we know... Uh, what the password is. Let's get in there. Project overview. Okay, they're coming in again. Come on. Where are you, you filthy creature? Fusion cells I'll take. Oh, he is down on the ground. I thought he was up high for a second. More fusion cells. I probably shouldn't pick those up so much because I don't have a... I'm not using an energy weapon. Which is something I probably ought to remedy as well. Uh... Yeah, I don't see any adhesives right offhand. Alright. Find... Okay, establish a device link with the terminal. Scanning device configuration, establishing link, good. Done. Collect water data, holotape, soil data, and air data holotapes. Are you kidding me right now? These are for the blood samples. Wow. Wow. How am I supposed to do that as a daily? That's stupid. That's so much traveling. Ouch. I really don't have the time for that. Um, so, sadly, I'm going to have to leave it here. Let's head over to the base. Uh and get in. I think what I may do next episode is uh, change up my base a little bit, reduce the size, and try to get some uh, plants going. 
especially for the vegetable starch so that I can get uh, adhesives collected because I think it should be pretty easy uh, to fit all this stuff in a 2x2 two two. because if you think about it we just take this row out and cram all this stuff into a tighter radius. I don't know how the stairs are going to work in a 2x2 two two, though. Uh, that might be a little questionable but I will I will find a way to figure it out for sure. Okay, well that's going to do it for this episode then. If you want to catch another one, be sure to subscribe. Consider supporting my channel through the Patreon link down in the video description. And feel free to check out any of my other videos or playlists that you might be interested in. I thank you so much for all the time you spend on my channel. And I hope blessings of wisdom and peace on all of you. Farewell.